sir. Please take a seat. Thank you. Thank you. What do you think about their company? What do you think could you contribute and how will you able to fit in? I hear many good things about here. There, I hear good from friends. Management is good. They're good CSR. And I think Great Builders is global leader because they always contribute to society. Um, I think that I can contribute because I good with math. Very well, but you do know you want to apply for the marketing department, am I right? But how long did you study English? Uh, yes, I studied two years English in China. But three years ago, I came here, I studied a little more. Maybe about one year. I think I qualify because I good speaking with others. So you said that you are qualified for this job. Can you elaborate more on this? What do you mean? Sir, can you explain why you are qualified for this job? I think I qualify for this job because I work hard. I very good at math and I do not stop until work is finished. Yes, it may be true that you're a hardworking person, but maybe that's not suitable for the marketing department. What? Why do you think I'm not qualified for marketing department? What I mean is that you're a good applicant. But you seem to lack a bit of communication skills and that is what our marketing department is looking for. We can refer you to a different department if, you, if you're really interested in our company. But we really need smooth communication in marketing and English is the most common language used and we don't want to risk the trust of our shareholders. What do you think about their company? What do you think could you contribute and how will you able to fit in? Well, there are a number of reasons why I chose this company. Number one, I think we have a good management system and um, people, the employees get good benefits here. Number two, I think you have a very great CSR program in a lot of people. And number three, I think your company is a good leader. Okay, good. So, how long have you been speaking English or like how long are you experiencing speaking the language. You're interested in the marketing department, am I right? Well, usually people because in Manila, they like to speak English, but there are people who are either straight who speak English or they do Well, I came from a family because I'm really speak straight English. And I came from the South, it's one of the students that speak English. Well, I think I'm qualified because I was going to have a joint Increase or decrease? Down by 2.9. Okay. 
Okay, how about the funds of their from their investments? Go up. By how much? Only 0.5 cent. Um, Zoe, I know you're very good at your job, but as a team leader, I need you to give me fast and precise responses. I have a responsibility to go around the department and oversee the progress of everybody, and I want you to improve yourself if you still want to stay as team leader because I know your English isn't good enough, but you have to exert extra effort for it, okay? Okay, sorry sir. Ma. I'm sorry Zoe, but I feel like I have to assign somebody else to take over your job for now. Um, this is Lester. He will temporarily take your job until you improve. So I really hope you improve, okay? Okay, thank you. I know very well why I have gathered all of you here today. It's because of the misunderstanding that's happening between you and our customers. Uh, is it because of our English? I have gathered all of you here today to train all of you and your English communication skills and to develop your sense of unity as a team. Mom, how hard English I am bad at English? English is not that difficult. If you dedicate yourself, I am sure that at the end of this training session, everyone will be able to speak in fluent English. Thank you everyone for attending this English speaking program, and I hope that you, everyone can speak in English now and understand. Thank you, ma'am, for letting us learn the English language and to use it properly in our company.